day. It's 45 in the morning. I have my own more to wake. So I am going to take an early morning walk. I have to return something at the library. And then that'll be my morning walk for the day. And then I have other things. I have that to do. And then a friend of mine wants me to accompany them for an eye doctor appointment this afternoon to help them pick out a new style of glasses. You guys know I'm all about style. Not to brag. I said yes, I will definitely do that. And then tomorrow is a very special day. And we're off to return a DVD. My sister and I watched a movie Sunday night, so I have to return the DVD. And then I'm going to accompany my friend to their eye appointment. Outfit of the day. Converse. And yellow, because your girl likes yellow. Oh, look. It's a friend. But I'm still walking, because it's beautiful out, and it's actually kind of cool out, which is why I'm kind of glad I wore this flannel. Okay. I also have my pearl, like, not pearl, I mean, like, cream-colored rose earrings. And my blue Converse, well, uh, navy blue. But that's my attire for today. As I mentioned, I have something very exciting going on tomorrow. Tomorrow's the big day. I am going to finally finish my dad's tattoo and get his date below the cross that I've had for four years. If nobody knows what I'm talking about, go on and check out my personal channel. My personal channel has a tattoo playlist to all of the tattoos that I've had and stories behind them. So go on and check that out if you're new. Please do not worry. I do have personal channel content on the way. One of which is going to be talking about this tattoo probably after I get it because I don't know about filming. Just it's going to be something super quick. We'll see. DVD has been dropped off. Heading back home. I <clears throat> will be talking to you guys about the tattoo and everything later on and then kind of just tidying up. Talk to you guys then. Home sweet home. It is almost like 20 of 3. Went and got the mail. Looks like a piece of junk if you want me to be real. <laughs> Looks like a piece of junk. I wanted to show you a necklace that I got from a friend of mine. It is absolutely beautiful. It is this necklace that's gold, but it has, I don't know if you can tell, but they're green little flowers. And it's something that is out of my comfort zone. And what I mean by that, it's not like one solid color, but it is just a dainty, kind of like a choker, and it's the adjustable. You can see it's the adjustable chain back here. So you can make it shorter or longer. I prefer when it's necklaces like this to be a little bit shorter. That's just my style. Got back home. The eye appointment for my friend took a bit longer than usual. So I ended up just waiting in their car in the air conditioning because I got tired of I got tired of just sitting there in that waiting room. I'm sorry I haven't been vlogging very much. Um, like I said earlier, I do have personal channel content coming about the tattoo that I'm getting tomorrow. I'm hoping that I can do like a before and after shot. Um, because I, I don't know, before and after of a tattoo is just so like aesthetically pleasing. 
But I am thankful that I got my hair cut the other day because it is pretty warm out there. And this is coming from a girl that's wearing jeans. But again, I don't really care. It is technically the end of August. It is the 29th, so we're getting close. But I got a good walk in. I returned the DVD. And then we went to my friend's eye appointment. They did pick out a pair of glasses, but their script um, really hasn't changed. And so the new glasses are not necessary as of right now. However, if the time comes that they do want to get the new pair of glasses that we did pick out, they can get them when the time comes and when they want to change frames and glasses. I can't believe I'm going like under the, what I call under the knife basically tomorrow. But I'm so excited. My dad's tattoo right here is finally just going to be finished and it's going to have my dad's date underneath here. I'm thinking of just doing 11 for 17 because this is such a small space. I'm, I'm thinking of doing something pretty just clean and simple for, clean and simple for, um, the date tattoo right here, but I'm really excited for it because I just I just want it to be complete since I've had this for four years already. Right now, I'm a little full of ice cream as well. We stopped at this place called Curver Cream on the way back. It's a basic, it's a basic old-fashioned soft serve ice cream place that's really, really good. So if anybody is in the area of like Wolf Road area, definitely recommend Curver Cream. Anyways, I'm going to go on ahead and wrap this up. Hopefully you guys got a glimpse of my day, and hopefully you'll get a glimpse of the tattoo tomorrow. I'm hoping to do what I said is a before and after with the ink stencil and then the ink when it's fully finished. I'm not sure how that's going to go, but crossing my fingers, I can do something. On that note, I'm going to go on ahead and wrap up this vlog. Thank you all so much for watching. Thank you for your patience. More content will be coming. Stick around for fall.